Good evening, everyone. Along with Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich, and an air of expectancy about this game because when you walk through the turnstiles and you go up to your seat, you know you're going to get to see the top point getter in the league, and that's a thrill. Who doesn't love to see goals and points, Doc? And when you have the leading scorer in the entire league on the ice, he's going to get a lot of attention from the other team's best defensive players. Okay, so let's look at the starting goaltenders for the game. Johnson's the starter again tonight. He plays really large in the net, doesn't give the opponent much to shoot at, hoping to come up big for the Flames. Semyon Varlamov, a world traveler, has played for the Hershey Bears, the Washington Capitals, Colorado Avalanche, overseas, a part of the rejuvenation of the Avs, and represented his native Russia in the Olympics. The teams are ready, and so are we. Monahan's a good face-off man, ready for Calgary. Duchesne's out there to try to beat him for the Avalanche. Scorches one. Flips a wrister, and a save. A snow angel, and he sealed it. And let's head down to ice level. Here's Ray Ferraro. Johnson's had an excellent season so far. He's got a high winning percentage, way more wins than losses. He's made enough saves that gives his team a chance to get their feet underneath them when they don't play very well. But he's been pretty consistent this year. We'll see if the opposition can get somebody in his eyes tonight, make it difficult for him to see the puck. Many thanks, Ray. Gains the blue line. On the outside, a shot. Terrific save with a pass. Loose, but he froze it. Stoppage of play. Johnson's able to make an excellent stop here. That's a difficult scoring chance. The shooter thought he had him beat. Calgary's got a face-off win. Trying to go to Goudreau. Still on the move in center ice. Laid on to Goudreau. That one blocked. The former Hobie Baker Award winner given to the best college hockey player in the United States, Johnny Goudreau, played at Boston College and started his NHL career with the Calgary Flames. Good job on the draw. And now it's directed to Duchesne. Moved along and in. Shoots one. Block that one. Saucer to Landeskog. Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. It's blocked. That's what those pads are for. Benny holds on. Been a long time since this wasn't the garden variety stop for a goalie. Down in the butterfly, turned aside. Defensive zone win. The Flames are moving the puck in neutral ice. On to Brower. Didn't miss by much. In this situation, you have to hit the net. Sometimes it's best just to fire it right at the goaltender. Shoots one. Gathered in by Brower. With a blast. Right at the net, and he got his pad on it. And the puck is grabbed by Weidman. Good takeaway by Duchesne. Slid to Tutin. Gets in. What'll he do? To Polak. The Flames recoiling back in their own end. Slides it to the point. You could almost count that one, but no. Colorado's moving the puck up the wing. Scooped up by Landeskog. Puck free. The Flames are controlling in their own end. Pitching this one to chase on. Chris shot. He scores.
look at the shots on goal in the first period. Nine for Calgary and eight for Colorado. We have 20 minutes down. We have lots of time still to go. What are your thoughts so far, Edson? The Avs are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. Puck dropped and the clock moving in the second period. Pointed to Polak. Wonderful stop. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Fires! That shot came from nowhere. Gets play stopped. Solid, clean win. Colorado setting things up at center. And he gains the zone. Wristed one. Oh, and a great opportunity denied by that pass. Pass would not go. Canceled out by a physical play. And snap to Johnson. Block. Dogged determination there by Gabriel Landeskog. Deals it to Barry. A shot. Marvelous breakaway. Calgary's up the wing settling things. Back near the blue line to Monaghan. Great poke check. And he freezes for the whistle. Johnson's going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. Clean win on the draw. Snapping a pass to Polak. Up the wing still with possession and with hope. Shot. That's a marvelous save. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Save. Puck covered. Whistle blown. Johnson's always had excellent leg speed. Here he makes a great pad stop. Good face-off man. Tries to get it on net. Loose puck, solid. Great save at the edge of the crease. Great pressure. Pass down into the corner. Fires in front. Wonderful save. He covers, and a face-off will follow. Johnson's able to scramble back into position to make an excellent stop here. Just under five minutes remaining. The Flames are ahead, two to nothing. Nice face-off work. Calgary's lugged it back into their own end. Gains the zone. Good solid defensive play there. Standing point blank save. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Barlamov's athleticism was tested on that wrist shot. That was an excellent scoring chance. They win the draw. Hammers one. Nicely into the zone. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Pass attempt to backlift. Directing that one to Bowman. On through the corner. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. A cover, and play is stopped. minutes have been played a rest is deserved all right time to turn to the shots on goal and look at some impressive totals 26 for Colorado and 19 for Calvin the Flames goaltender has
has not buckled yet. He's made some strong saves, but this one of the most recent big ones as we go to break. Third period about to begin. What did you think of the second? Colorado's coaching staff, Doc, has to be pretty pleased the way they played through the first 40 minutes of play. One area of concern has been their offense. They need to take advantage of all the time of possession and finally put the puck into the back of the net. Passing one off now to Polak. Puck is thrown to Duchesne. Turn the wrist shot. Great save. An unbelievable stop from a high scoring area. Pitching it to Froli. Good stick there, so the pass is not complete. Chip, a wonderful shot answered quickly. Wonderful save. Colorado's looking to head man up the wing. Hammer, got his stick on it. That was a pass that just went south, and so everybody has to get back out. Puck controlled by Johnson. Colorado's in possession now as they move up the wing. Took that wrist shot. A terrific shot, but it's answered by the pad. He's in on an onside play. Kicked away. Moving it to Duchesne. Looking to McKinnon. Good poke check by Barry. To Froli. Fires a shot. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right here. The shooter thought he'd made a pretty good shot here, but the goaltender's in good shape. He makes the stop, and he's able to deny the shooter on what he thought was an excellent chance. Colorado's prevailed on another face-off. Carried right through the middle of the neutral zone. Johnny Goudreau, that Hobie Baker award winner out of Boston College, gets the puck. The Flames look to make a difference up the wing. Good hand to eye and the reach of the stick. Propelled to Duchesne. A shot. Nearly grazed the iron on that. Here's one of those times where you look at the net and there's... Tuck it up high. He scores! Matt Duchesne! Goalie made the initial stop with those quick hands. Beat him on the rebound. Johnson's rebound control hasn't been great over the last little while. This is another one. It's just sitting there, ready to be pounced upon. Colorado's gotten the game even, and who knows what will happen next. Somebody's got to break this tie, or we'll do it in OT. Over seven minutes left to go in the third. A hockey game is one of lead changes, and this one has seen its lead vanish. To Duchesne. Trying to go to Polak. Hammers it. Score! That's three unanswered goals. in the high slot and he rips home a slapper. Johnson's reaction shows that he knew he was going to go up top with the shot, Eddie, but he just couldn't get there. Colorado's got the lead now by one. Third period of play. It'll be a wonderful finish. Colorado's got that neutral zone faceoff. Number 24, assisted by number nine. And possession established on the pickup by Landis Carr. Calgary is recoiling back in their own end. Lofted back in, and the forwards get to the bench. And now it's directed to Landeskog. They made it! When you're thinking about taking a wrist shot, it's all about weight transfer. 
transferring your weight from your back foot to your front foot when you're shooting that puck. That's exactly what happened there. Barlamov's unable to clean up the mess in front of him. What a mistake defensively in front of the net. Calgary's goal has tied this game up. A fun ride to the finish for all of us now. Neutralized face-off win. The Flames want to generate something up the wing. Hammers one. Great work with the pad. Good place to shoot from. And that one went out of play over the glass. A souvenir for some young fans. Polak's offensive production stems from the fact that he's able to get away from the guy checking him for just a second to release the puck. That is a skill that people don't talk about. Some have it, some don't. Who's got the next goal? We're nearing the end. Sauced. Score! Pollock's roof tickler goes in from the high slot. Landeskog's able to clear open ice, and he lays a sweet saucer pass on the shooter's stick. The Abs have broken the tie here in the third period. So what will be their philosophy now? We'll probably see it from this opening faceoff. And they've won the faceoff. Into the attacking end. We are in the last minute. A brilliant save! Amazing reflexes. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. Slides it to the point to Bruni. He missed the net. Oh, he'd love to have that chance back. That would have tied it up. The Flames yank their goalie to try and get this back. Shift. Ooh, stick save. Landis Gobbs in his own end headed towards center. Snapped up the wing. Net open. Not there. Net open. Gets in. What'll he do? Shot on goal. Outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. Oh, and he missed the net. And there it is. The game is over. The Avs have another win. And their winning streak continues. With that win, Doc, they found themselves with a tidy streak intact. And the wins just keep on coming. Contest two teams gave their 